Merry Christmas, baby. I'm over here on the bread aisle. It smells so good. <laughs> Welcome to the coffee station. <laughs> Merry Christmas, baby. Surely treat you nice. Good morning. Good morning, people of Victory. How are you today? Good morning. Welcome back to this Christmas day. Hey, and I am your girl, Nikki, Nikki Nicole, Nikki B, whichever one you want to use. You can just call me Nicole. It doesn't even matter. But welcome back. It's day eight. It's this Christmas day eight. And as you know, you know, I already know the reason for this Christmas is dedicated to my son. If you look right here on my right, he's sitting right there in, on a picture right between that. There's the Christmas tree over there that I found yesterday, y'all. And I'm solely, truly excited about. I still got to decorate it. Don't worry about that. That's coming. But anyway, I just want to welcome you back. If you are new to the channel, welcome. If you are new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you can know every time I upload a video, hit the notification bell so it'll come straight to you and you will know. But anyway, just came in to say good morning. I'm already up and edit. Got to make a quick errand. Today is a work day, so it's going to be another short and quick vlog on today. But yeah, we're going to get it in. So with that being said, let's get into the video. at my sleeve I do believe it's Christmas it's cold outside but I'm warm within cause Christmas time is here the camera is right up in my face but I left my tripod in the car because I said I wasn't going to vlog in here for y'all I'm over here on the bread aisle it smells so good like <laughs> like, have you ever just paid attention to how good they smell? Like, the bread I smells good. And, oh, it just smells so good, y'all. I don't know if it's, if it's the bread or if I'm just hungry. But it smells so good. <laughs> That's all I want to say. Like I'm at Kroger's right now. Like, you know, you can use the Kroger card to get the stuff for the sale price, right? But if I'm gonna get a six pack of bottle drinks and your sale price is $4.99, that's not a sale. Cause I can go to Walmart and get a six pack of drinks for $2.50, no more than $2.67. That's why I go to Walmart a lot. But you definitely need a Kroger card when you come in Kroger's. I mean, you know, unless you just got it like that. You don't, you know, have to save. But for those of us that do, make sure you have your Kroger card when you come. That's all I'm saying. It's probably not no good footage at all, y'all, because this camera is just going everywhere because I don't have my tripod in the car. But... On my way home. Bye. I'm mastering this traffic thing. Like, I, I, it's no traffic right now. Like, it's 10, about 10, 15 in the morning. Y'all. So, I would say after like 9 ish, 9 15, whatever, probably be the best time if you're trying to get out and do your shopping. Probably would be the best time, you know, so you won't be in a whole lot of traffic. Because, like, I'm already at, at the house, which, like I say, everything is pretty much around me anyway. Like, if you're not doing your Christmas shopping, just a little, you know, nugget out there. If you're in Texas, if you're in Houston, you know, unless you just like me and all that, that traffic, um, I would say the best time to go is, like, you know, right after everything died down, school traffic, work traffic, it's 
so much better, y'all. I'm learning it. Like, that's why when I go to work, I leave out almost an hour early so I can beat that 5 o'clock traffic. So, yeah, like, you gotta learn how to master it, boo. I, I remember when I first moved here, people was like, good luck on the traffic. But, you know, it, it's all in you. You have to take the time, pay attention, and then you'll master it. But anyway, y'all, about to get up in this house and get things situated, take these little bags in, and uh, get back in the bed. <laughs> That's what I'm finna do. So, anyway. Bye, y'all. Hey, y'all. Hey, so I'm back home. I'm um, just gonna go through these few little things that I got from the store right quick. Just a quick little haul. Then we're gonna go from there. Caramel Mochiato Ice Coffee. Starbucks Caramel Flavored Coffee. Ready Whip Whipped Cream. Caramel Syrup and Caramel Topping. Caramel Rice Crisp. Turkey Hill Lemonade Tea. The Smoked Sausages by Eckridge. Tastes so good. Some bananas. That's it. Hey, y'all. Come hang out with me while I make my winter eggnog spice iced coffee. Okay, we're gonna choose our coffee, which we're gonna use the Starbucks pumpkin spice. You can purchase this at your local grocery store. All right, then we're just gonna go ahead and put that in our curing to get ready to brew our coffee. To each his own, I'm using warm coffee because I think the flavor is better, but you can use the cold brew if you choose to. It's more convenient. So while that coffee is brewing, we're just gonna inhale it. And these are our ingredients that we're gonna use, which is caramel, cinnamon and then we have a mixture in the Santa jug which is caramel creamer and eggnog so let's get started first we're going to put in some caramel you can mix it however you want to I use caramel to sweeten all of my coffee Then we're gonna put just some cinnamon in there and we're just gonna use just a little bit. Be careful with your cinnamon. You only wanna just use kind of just like a little bit on the tip of your spoon, just a little bit because you don't want your coffee to taste all gritty. So just a little tad bit. Then just a spoon of sugar. I prefer brown, but I was out. And then now we're just gonna add the creamer. And again, it is caramel creamer mixed with eggnog then we're just gonna stir it we're gonna stir up that flavor give it a good stir stir it up real well and now we're getting ready to prepare our contents or our products for drinking so we're gonna add a little ice to our cup it's not iced coffee if you don't have no ice in it. <laughs> and so now we're going to pour our content over the ice. And then we're going to stir that again, stir that flavor up again so it can be good and flavorable. Then I'm just going to top that off and add some whipped cream. That looks so enticing. <laughs> and y'all know I cannot leave out not topping it with that caramel. I really should have drizzled the glass, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like they do at Starbucks. I don't think I'm that good though. So here we have it. Winter Spice Eggnog Iced Coffee made by me, Nikki B. So I hope you've enjoyed that. So let's give it a taste. Really tastes good, y'all. It really does.
Hey you guys, welcome to the coffee shop. So today I just wanted to show you guys a few of the Christmas coffee mugs that I found within my budget. Um, just a few festive things that you can have for guests or just for yourself or just to decorate around your house or to use every day during Christmas time to drink out of. First, we have here the Merry Christmas. It's a tumbler. Um, purchased from Family Dollar was $1. You can use it for your iced coffees um, or, you know, simply just walking around the house or on the go um, for your iced coffees. Um, then also... It has a place in it for your straw. You put a straw in it. So when you make your iced coffee at home and you've got to leave out the house, you have something to put your drink in. So then next we have the Peace um, Coffee Mug, um, which I purchased also from Family Dollar. And that was retailing at $2. Um, you can pick that up at your local Family Dollar around your area. And it's a nice cup. It is glass. And then next we have your Let It Snow mug, also um, from Family Dollar. It was one dollar. And then we have your there's uh, I forgot what to say, <laughs> but that um, glass Christmas coffee mug came from Big Lots. It was four dollars if I'm not mistaken. And then my favorite, which is the Santa milk jug, y'all, is made of glass. Um, I got a percentage off. It was originally $5, but I got it for, for $4. That was also a big lot. I wish I would have got the cup that I seen y'all that was made with a sweater, which was super cute, but I didn't get it. And last but not least, this happens to be my next favorite. I think it's this is my best favorite. The Starbucks coffee mug. Fa la 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 la. <laughs> It's the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. Definitely gonna be drinking out of there, y'all. Retail at five dollars, and I got there from your local Walmart. So here are the drinks, and I just wanted to just bring them to you. These were was um, within my budget, but there are several coffee mugs out there um, to shop for. They got some good ones, y'all. So anyway, hope y'all enjoyed that. Love ya. Merry Christmas. See you later. I hope you guys are enjoying this Christmas as well as I am. I am having so much fun. This wraps up this Christmas Day 8. I will see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you can know when I upload my next video. Love you. Peace.